Here today I wanted to show you an overview of G Sky Skyer's uh, reflector telescope. So this is the telescope here. Assembly is pretty easy. It took me about uh, nine minutes. I'll try to show you in a video at the end of this to show you the building process. But it's fairly easy. There's no tools that are required. Um, everything is just assembles together with uh, the supplied wing nuts and little clips. But the legs are made of aluminum. You're able to adjust them by twisting this wing nut here. And they do have a little pointed edge on the bottom. Uh, also included is this little tray to hold uh, all the different eyepieces. So it's all aluminum, so it's not too heavy, but it, it is well balanced. On the bottom here, you have a, another wing nut that allows you to swivel the telescope side to side and then lock it into place. On the top here, we also have a couple more wing nuts that allow you to pivot the telescope up and down. And also, there's a little piece here that is to act to give it a little smoother flow when you're pivoting and then lock it into place. So, that's that side. Here on the bottom, we have the knob that uh, lets you to adjust or focus on whatever you're looking at. As you can see, it has little teeth there on the bottom. In the front, we have the lens. This is plastic, but this is metal. See on the side here, we have uh, the telescope that allows you to focus on what you want to focus at on first. And you simply turn to uh, focus on whatever you're looking at. fell down. Oh, and all of the pieces have little caps to protect them from uh, dust. So onto the actual eyepiece. So it does come with three, a 25, a 10, and an extra three. And these simply come on and off by twisting the little knob here. And it comes out. And same with this one. So like I said, assembly of a telescope is fairly easy. Like I said, it took me about 10 minutes or so, maybe less. But there it is. Just wanted to give you a quick overview of the telescope.